Hello, this is our Claims ML Shiny application. It uses machine learning to predict the status and payment on individual insurance claims for 10 years into the future. Additional information on the machine learning models used to create this application is available in a blog post. A link to the post is below this video on YouTube. Okay, so assume we are a company that sells workers' compensation insurance. This app can show us how much we expect to pay on the claims that have been reported to us. The claims have already been reported and the app predicts individual claim payments over the next 10 years. Here on the overview tab, we see the predicted losses for all claims combined. The top boxes show the mean expected loss, the expected loss of the 25% confidence level, and 75% confidence level. The chart shows the expected losses by accident year. The blue columns are the mean expected payment and the error bars show the confidence levels. The confidence levels can be adjusted here. We are currently looking at predicted losses with each claim capped at 500,000, but we can adjust the per claim retention limit here. So now we are looking at a 250K per claim retention limit. This chip table shows the expected unpaid loss retained, seeded, and the confidence levels for the unpaid loss prediction. We can apply filters to the claims to, for example, only look at predicted losses on claims from certain workers' compensation class codes. Or we could only look at back injuries, for example. Okay, so now we have a picture of the aggregated expected unpaid losses. We can move over to the breakdown tab to get a little bit more granular view of our model's predictions. In this top chart, we are looking at aggregated payments on all our workers' compensation claims. The claims are paid out by calendar year, so we can expect to pay 1.88 million in 2019, 790K in 2020, 420K in 2021, and so on. We can click on a calendar year to drill down and see the payments by accident year. Switch from incremental to cumulative payments and we can download the chart here. All the charts can be downloaded. This table displays the same information as the above chart. Calendar year payments go from left to right, but in the table we can see the breakdown by accident year over in this column, so there's no drill down necessary. Download the table here. These payments are at a 1 million retention limit, so as before we can adjust the retention limit and we can filter to only look at specific types of claims. Okay, so now let's look at payments by individual claim. Each column here represents the predicted payment for an individual claim. You can click the claim to view additional information about the prediction. On the left is a predicted distribution of possible payments for the full 10-year period. For this claim, we expect to pay 360,000 at the 95% confidence level. On the right, we see the simulated payment pattern by calendar year. And on this last tab, we can examine information about the different predictor variables. There's a link to the live app below this video on YouTube. Please feel free to explore the app on your own. Okay, that's it for this video. There's a lot more that can be done with individual claim payments. I look forward to hearing your ideas. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks.